I never thought we were gonna kill this turkey. This bird schooled us several times. But in the end, well, you'll see. Welcome to Blackjack TV. So this is one of the hardest birds, I think, that we've ever hunted. So the story of this turkey really begins on May 1st, 2020. It was opening day here in New York State. It's the day that Aaron killed his long beard. And at the same spot, we heard a turkey goblin with a hen way back in the woods behind us. And Aaron ended up killing his bird before he got there. So we knew it was just a matter of time before this bird would resurface. So when he did, we scouted him, we roosted him, and we got on him. But at this point, we had no idea what we were dealing with. All right. Good morning. Blackjack game calls. We roosted a bird in this corner last night. He's within 100 yards of us. We're hoping he pitches this field right here in this corner. And then he'll be in gun range if he does. Fingers crossed. If we didn't smoke him, setting up this blind, we didn't make a lot of noise. But it was very dark too, but it's a full, full moon. So it is bright out comparatively at 3.30 than it normally would be. So. Stick with us. We're really hoping to get it done. So the first time that we ever hunted this turkey, uh, we had him and his hens roosted. His hens pitched the field, came pretty close to our decoys, and they kind of stood there like waiting for the tom to come out and he never showed. And Aaron and I looked at each other scratching our heads like, we cannot believe this turkey is smart enough to not show up when all three of his hens come out to the field. Every time we hunted this turkey, we would roost him the night before and he would go from the field up into a tree. So we always were trying to hunt him on the field. But every time we did that, he would fly down and stay in the woods. So I changed up my tactics. I decided to get really close to the roost with him and you guys will see what happens. He's gone to the woods every day. Today he fits the field. I don't know what else more I can do to kill, kill this bird. Oh. Yet again, he schooled me. I got 30 yards from the tree that he was roosted in and I thought he was gonna pitch almost right into my lap, but instead he flew out to the field for the first time. The first time that Aaron and I hunted this turkey, we decided to leave a ground blind up and stake it down and leave it there. So we always had that option. So. After this bird had schooled me a bunch of times, I kind of started to think I'm gonna hunt the blind and I'm just gonna kind of be in the area and hopefully he makes a mistake. The next morning I decided to gamble and go all in and bring the strutter decoy with me. I figured that if he saw it, I had a slight chance of him getting mad and coming in. 
especially since he was the type of bird that he was. But I also had the chance of him seeing it and spooking it not coming in at all. We're down in New York State, buddy. In one way or another, scouting, trying to find him, getting on him, failing over and over, but eventually, you defy the odds. All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna try to get his beard beard out here. It's not much of a beard, but he's got some hooks. Inch and an eighth at least. 
So, this is him, the bird I've been trying trying to kill forever here. He finally has been laid to rest. I have a lot of respect for this bird. Saw him in the tree yesterday, was 30 yards from his tree, watching him gobble. And he flew and spooked and did something weird. This morning decided to hunt the blind because I knew it was going to be kind of foggy and misty and it might rain, so I wanted to film. He he saw that strutter and was not happy. So now, now I know why he came into the strutter, because this bird is not afraid. He's heavy, he's got hooks, couldn't be happier. Finally got it done. Aaron was supposed to come and hunt with me today. He slept in, so he'll be pumped when he finally wakes up here. Um, and other than that, I really don't know what to say. The blind helps. I got it on film. Bird in the dirt. Nice hooks too.